It has been a mess all day, Ugh. but Route 3 in New Jersey is finally reopened just a few minutes ago. It was closed all day after a salt truck took down several utility lines and poles. This is a busy stretch of road just west of the New Jersey Turnpike Eastern Spur. The accident caused major backups, so this is finally some good news for commuters making the trip from Manhattan through the Lincoln Tunnel. We've got team coverage. Eyewitness News reporter Stefan Kim near the Lincoln Tunnel, but we begin with Shannon zone live in news copter seven over route three shannon yeah and it is finally reopened we can do a little holler here but maybe a day late and a dollar short so let's show you what you need to know as you travel through the area and let's talk first about the eastbound side because you see cars coming through here on the eastbound side which is where the incident actually took place at about 6 30 this morning but and there is a caveat here. The cars you see coming through are coming off of the New Jersey Turnpike. This is a slow reopen to the closure that is in place. We're going to bring you back towards Route 120. And you can see that cars are still being pushed off here. They have yet to pick up the cones in that area. So if you are on the eastbound side of Route 3, your closure is still in place, although it is around the corner from being picked up right now, though your delays are back to Route 21. All right, so let's go back to where the incident occurred and let's show you what is happening on the westbound side of the roadway because this has been really important for the commute because it had been shut down just coming out of the Lincoln Tunnel on the westbound side at 495 and you can see that closure has been lifted but here's the thing these delays are all going to ease from front to back so where you're looking right now doesn't look that bad but the damage was already done through Union City through North Bergen all of your side streets Tunnelly Avenue backed up as far as you can see and we have Safan Kim on the ground by the Lincoln Tunnel and while it's getting better here Safan I imagine you're still seeing a little bit like a parking lot over there. Yes, yeah, Shannon, this is the Manhattan side of the Lincoln Tunnel, and about an hour ago it was wide open. Since then, we've seen traffic beginning to build up, but keep in mind we're in the middle of evening commute, so traffic at this hour isn't that unusual. If all lanes hadn't reopened, then this may have become a bigger headache as the evening wore on, but that is no longer a concern. This was caused by a dump truck that pulled down several live utility lines and poles 6.30 this morning in Secaucus, shutting down all lanes of Route 3 in both directions, as you mentioned. That dump truck's bed raised then became caught on power lines above. Meanwhile, NJ Transit bus service is warning of delays up to a half an hour. NJ Transit bus tickets and passes are being cross honored on several lines. A few hundred customers lost power, but PSE and G crews have since restored the power to all customers. The driver is OK, by the way. It's under investigation if this was a malfunction or if it was caused by driver error.